Hi guys, in this video we are going to consider how we might write a response that leads us to have to justify an answer. So what question we're going to look at in a little bit when we've been over this is should the government of China have introduced the one child policy? So we're going to look at how we might do that. However, we're just going to look at the term justify. And the term justify means the definition is to give detailed reasons for your decision based on evidence from your sources. So if we have multiple sources for the one child policy, we need to look at the pros and cons, and then we need to come out with a decision over whether we think that that policy should have been introduced. So it says here at the top, we will be um, talking about what the pros of the policy are, we'll be talking about what the cons of the policy are, and then we will be making a decision to justify our answer based on the pros and cons, whether we think that overall the one child policy was a good idea or not. So what we need to look at as well is we need to look at using connectives in our answers. So because this will be a, an, a longer answer, we all need to develop our statements, our um, arguments, and not just give kind of very short arguments. So we've got a range of connectives here that we can use. So when we make a statement, we can say this is because, we could say this led to, we could say, therefore, this is the consequence of, of the one child policy on social, economic or environmental impacts. We could say, however, if it was the opposite, when we get to our cons and we could say the consequences of the policy were or as a result of the policy, this led to. So we have to make sure that our reasons are well developed and not just simple. So it says here for your decision, the pros will outweigh the cons in your opinion and the choice will be made overall of whether you think that the one child policy was a good idea or not. So this is the question, should the Chinese government have introduced the one child policy? Justify your answer. So this answer will have three sections to it. The first section or the first paragraph will have the pros and we can use some of our connectives that we just talked about. The next paragraph will have the cons, so the negatives of the policy. And again, they can be developed. The um, impacts of the one child policy can be developed with the use of our connectives. And then the final one was where we decide on whether the policy should have been introduced or not. And we can make a decision based on either the pros or the cons and which we think had um, the uh, which was the best overall, which which decision would have been the best overall to have the policy or not have the policy. And as long as we back that up, then uh, we will be justified in our answer. So that is the key term justification.